Hey there, and welcome back to Electricity Frenzy. Today we're going to tackle a question that you might have asked yourself before, what happens if you plug a 110 volt appliance into a 220 volt outlet? It's an important question to ask because, unfortunately, accidents can happen. And when it comes to electricity, accidents can be costly, dangerous, or even deadly. So, in today's video, we'll explore the risks associated with using the wrong voltage, as well as what you can do to prevent accidents from happening. Understanding Voltage Before we get into the risks of using the wrong voltage, let's take a moment to understand what voltage is. Simply put, voltage is the force that pushes electric current through a circuit. In the US, most homes and businesses have a voltage of 120 volts, while some appliances like dryers and ovens use 240 volts. So, when you buy an appliance, you need to check what voltage it requires and make sure that your electrical system can handle it. Risks of using the wrong voltage Now, let's talk about what can happen if you plug a 110-volt appliance into a 220-volt outlet. The first and most obvious risk is that the appliance will be damaged. This is because the higher voltage will cause the appliance's circuits to overload, leading to overheating, sparks, and even fires. In some cases, the appliance may even explode. But that's not the only risk. Using the wrong voltage can also put you and your home at risk. For example, if the appliance overheats and starts a fire, it could spread to other parts of your home. And if the appliance explodes, it could injure you or others nearby. How to prevent accidents So, how can you prevent accidents from happening? Well, the first and most important step is to check the voltage requirements of your appliances and electrical system. Make sure that everything matches up. If you're not sure what voltage your appliances require, check the manual or look for a label on the appliance itself. Secondly, if you're traveling abroad or moving to a new country, make sure to research the electrical system and voltage requirements of the country you're going to. This will help you avoid using the wrong voltage and potentially causing damage or harm. Finally, if you do accidentally plug a 110-volt appliance into a 220-volt outlet, don't panic. Unplug the appliance immediately, and don't try to use it again until it's been checked and repaired by a qualified electrician. Conclusion So, that's it for today's video. We hope that we've helped you understand the risks associated with using the wrong voltage and what you can do to prevent accidents from happening. Remember, electricity can be dangerous, so always take the necessary precautions to keep yourself and your home safe. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time on Electricity Frenzy. Before we go, I'd like to ask you to do us a small favor. If you found this video informative and helpful, please give